Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to a brand new video. Today we have a solo shuffle on a schedule and if you have watched the previous one uh, then you know which uh, build we are testing and that's the pure storm build where we don't take the elemental blast, don't take the lava lash and everything and in case you are wondering about that and you haven't checked the previous video make sure to do that. So this solo shuffle is gonna be once again tricky, we have a warrior, feral and a that's true warlock, but let's see what we can do out of it. Okay, the plan is to go warlock, obviously, we just can't let him cast. I'll start with some purges. Oh, okay. Let's waste interrupt. Okay, this is going to be me, cool. Okay, luckily that this is holy priest. Anyway, here's my wolfies. One for my dominance and let's deal some damage. Okay. Wrapped on power of fusion. Ooh, I said it's proc. Come on, come on. Using my earth elemental, my healing stream token, and refreshing my earth shield. Work. Yep, this warlock never stood a chance. To be honest, this warrior is quite an animal, so I'm a little afraid to go against him. Okay, first game so far so good. Uh, as you could see, very good damage and very cool element of surprise by the deeply rooted elements. So let's continue that. And now start with the warrior until that up appears. Okay, there he is. This guy first. Next, this dude, chill out. Okay, go for my wolf is the wins. Shamanism, and let's put this guy down. Okay, priest went to the angel form. So I'm gonna throw down that interrupt. Healing stream token, earth elemental. Wow, we are lowering both of us even though we are not close or anything. Ooh, no. No, that was so stupid that, that I wanted to go to Burrow, but I was waiting too long and I just haven't received any heal for a long time and I shouldn't die there well my bad very much my bad interrupting stable infliction immediately purging everything with him and let's go going straight for the good wins Again, sundering for every blast. Okay, just grounding and killing stream there. Well, there's my ancestral guidance as well. Interrupting this. Going for it, Wolfies. Healing in focus. Okay. Ooh, nice elements. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh, that kind of swap saved him. Okay. Give it interrupted. That was a very nice proc. Sundering on the lightning bolt. Ooh, going underground. Pumping them out. Come on, brother, kill me. Please. Yeah, I just threw the interrupt there. So dumb. Or it could be dead by now. Going for a uh, tremor totem. Just knocking them away. One. Interrupt with this. Nice. Well, second victory. Okay. Let's try to get this dub with the warlock. 
we're not gonna go for the feral obviously uh, here I decide to take the stone skin totem just to check these two guys if they are going to destroy it because they are two degenerate melees oh, come on the thing yeah he did a good stun here well I'll just use it straight away stun skin and then the healing stream destroy this are unpurgeable I swear Okay, for my full CDs, Sundering, ooh, very nice proc, we did a health swap, I'll just no way, their cleave was so insane previous game, it just couldn't be done much, but, uh, what the hell did I just interrupt there, so blind, this droid gotta chill out, they tricked me very well. Wanna hex the priest. Okay, he tricked it immediately. Nice. I guess we are free to pump the warlock now. I'm going stream totem going for my earth elemental because I can see that this feral is going nuts on us. Oh, I forgot to change the talents back to the grounding. Well, I hope that it doesn't bite us. Okay, going for that boom wins here and for my feral spirits. Gonna try to hex the priest. Oh, he did me shadow melt pull. He's hex now. Or should go down. Let's give my warrior some enhancement dropping the mind games. down the totems, yo, this feral is so annoying to be honest, I kinda wanna kill him, but you should stick the warlock, ooh, perfect, if you look at the proc, okay, then it is my after shift, dropping this from warlock, hexing the priest, and warlock, oh, was a DR on a hex. Not cool. Putting my totems down again, going underground. Using my battle master trinket. Come on, warrior, we gotta finish him. Nice, we did it. Okay, okay. That one was kinda close, but we managed to do it. Okay, first one being interrupted. Oh, oof, they did me so dirty there. Chill, chill, chill. I just did my domains for nothing. To be honest, there, this Russian healer is much better than the one that is in our steam okay okay, okay. Ah, they are both holy at this note oh very nice pro let's go let's go let's go okay going for my wolf is again sundering okay let's hope it's been done Hex, perfect. Let's knock him away and root him there. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Once again, perfect rock and interrupt. Goodbye, brother. Goodbye. Well, here we are. Four victories. Not bad. I'm pretty satisfied. So the solo shuffle is finished and. As you could see, this is how this build performs pretty much. Obviously, a uh, hard uh, solo shuffle for the poor warlock because he was surrounded by the melees, but the point here was to showcase you the damage and everything. And I did have a fail where I lost because they haven't used any defensive, but 
I was just relying on my healer too much and I haven't received a heal from him at that moment in a long time so I ended up dying and that was very stupid for me but overall the damage was so cool uh, it was always consistent I always had to do anything like I wasn't having the problem with uh, having all spells on cooldown and as you could see that element of surprise from deeply rooted elements has literally brought us the two victories because nobody had anything to stop it and I just pretty much nuked them away for that few seconds that I've got it. So yeah, I'm overall very happy with this pack, uh, it's going in a cool way and yeah, I am aware that I'm chasing the storm build but I'm using this full fire build but I have been waiting to get this mount for so long uh, in some way or form and I just gotta use this transmog this mount, yeah, it's, it's so cool. And yeah, I guess that will do for a video. If you guys are not subscribed and you wish to support me and you like my videos, actually, please do so. I'm trying to reach the 3000 subscribers before the start of summer, so that would mean a world to me. And yeah, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.